Hi, and welcome to this special video. Now, first of all, a big shout out to subscriber Dean for putting me onto this amazing deal from supermarket chain Aldi here in the UK as we go into Christmas shopping season. You can buy any of these Airfix starter kits for just $4.99 each. That's right, change from a fiver for a complete, proper Airfix kit. Now, let's remind ourselves what you get in a starter set like these. As an example, we're using the Hawker Hurricane starter set. The big thing, of course, is the bag of parts. There are 51 parts in this kit, for example. They're nicely molded and they'll take some simple detailing. Then, of course, we have the instructions in typical Airfix style. These are well drawn, clear, and very easy to understand. Just follow the steps one by one and you'll be fine. Then there's a set of decals with nice rich colours and very sharp printing. Now what makes this a starter set is a bag of these four humbrol paints that you need to paint your kit when it's done and a tube of polystyrene cement. Finally, a humble number two general purpose brush. Now I think that $4.99 for all of this is an absolute steal. On the side of the box here you can see that the starter sets are at skill level one, so they can be made by pretty much anyone. And it also comes with a flying hour token. Now, if you join the Airfix Club and collect these tokens, later on you can get yourself a free kit. So what kits can you choose from in this amazing offer? First up is the classic Spitfire Mark 1B. Now this is the kit that got me back into model making just under four years ago. It was given away with a national newspaper and I thought, why not? Now, here I am putting videos online. Anyway, this is the oldest of the six kits on offer. The molds are 11 years old, but it still looks clean and will make a cracking good model. Next is the Spitfire's famous Battle of Britain stable mate, the Hawker Hurricane Mark I. This is an aircraft of number 615 squadron from RAF Kenley in 1940. Now I've made quite a few Hurricanes in 172nd, and this is a good one. Simple to build, but plenty of detail there to pick out if we want to. From the other side of the battle in 1940 comes a Messerschmitt Bf 109, as flown in squadron JG 51 in 1940 by the gloriously named Werner Pichon Kalau von Hofer. This is a decent little kit as well with moulds dating from 2012 that still seem very fresh. Hey, maybe do one of these and one of the British fighters as a pair for a mantelpiece. From later in the war is the outstanding Focke-Wulf FW190. This one from JG26, based in Belgium just after D-Day in 1944. The FW190 is a lovely aircraft, compact and aggressive, and this kit is a joy to build. On down to the jet age, and here we have the hunting Percival Jet Provost. This was the RAF standard basic jet trainer for many years, with its clean lines and side-by-side -side seating so nothing could escape the critical gaze of your instructor. Now, this aircraft is painted all over red, the colours of the Red Pelicans display team in 1966. I can remember seeing these alongside the Red Arrows in the early 70s at air shows. This is the most recent kit, the moulds were made in 2016. Finally, for fans of ship models, this is a lovely starter set of the Mary Rose. Pride of King Henry VIII's navy, the Mary Rose sank in 1545, but in 1982 it was brought back to the surface. She now sits in a purpose-built museum as part of the Portsmouth Historic Dockyard. Now this will make an ideal gift for anyone in your life who might be studying the Tudors at school, for example, or for anyone who likes the history of ships. So there we have it, six amazing kits for just $4.99 each. Now, if you'll pardon the pun, these are flying off the shelves. Many have already sold out online. 
So get yourself down to your local Audi store. They might not be that easy to find. You'll have to dig around in a bin with other things, but at this price, it's well worth the effort to find the perfect stocking filler. Now I'm gonna build all six of these kits before Christmas and put the build videos online on my channel. So please remember to subscribe below. Come Christmas day, you can tell whoever gets this gift where to go to get advice on how to build it. You might also want to look at my top 10 tips and tricks for new model makers also on my channel. Thanks very much for watching. Good luck finding these kits and I'll see you next time.